Are you gonna say hey or are you gonna be weird? Hello. <laughs> are you gonna take my drink from me? Okay, so I promised I'd update when we got home. <coughs> it's 9.30 and he's gonna go take a shower. Okay, bye. Okay, so he's ready in the shower. I still look this bad. Got my drink. And um, so I like full intended on having like a much better video today, but I promised I was going to upload one. I need to upload one today. So I'm just going to give like a quick life update. Everything's crazy. You can see Jack's chair in the background, which I am going to do um, like an updated um, how I feed him because actually I've gotten quite a bit of like comments and messages um, about feeding him and stuff. So and junk. This is just life today. Um, so I think I am going to film that this week. And then I'm on keto with my really good friend Taylor. So I think I might do like what I eat in a day on keto. And um, I wish I had somewhere I could put y'all. But I don't know if I do. It's probably not a good angle. I, um, I bought this like little phone stand. Okay, that's going to work for now. Um, what, was I gonna, what was I saying? So, um, so I think I'm going to do that, um, but y'all can kind of let me know what y'all want to see. So like I was like going to give y'all updates, what we're doing, where we're living, house updates, babies, jobs, like all kind of fun stuff. So, um, but I wanted to just kind of get up here because I've been totally in my A. I have spray tan on my hand, really cute. Um, don't have all the rest of my wedding rings on. Um, if you ever like watch me this was my grandmother's ring my gold band so it's mostly what you'll see me in um because it's my fave i mean obviously my my like engagement ring that joel gave me is like prize possession but i love this because i'm always like cooking cleaning like doing crap with joel like hence my like sweatshirt that i live in um and my hair's a mess i got a massage earlier and so like my hair is just terrible so and I'm just repping. Actually, I was just helping Dad um, pack like the radios and stuff because he's traveling to the race this weekend. So it's really exciting. And I'll film that maybe watching that. Um, so yeah, just some fun stuff. Um, so yeah, just kind of a little bit of a life update. I'll probably do um, maybe like a Q and A or something to kind of like really let you know like what's up with life and everything but I just wanted to get this up here really fast today so that I could post a video and just say welcome back um lots has changed um just like what we're doing like what's going on and everything um yeah so I love y'all and um comment and say hey i know this is just like a short all over the place video with my hat on and you don't even know what i look like but um i'm glad to be back and i really am going to try to do better about getting these up because i really miss y'all like and enjoy interacting with y'all so i love y'all and i will talk to you soon okay so i'm back different scenery so, I wanted to come on here and chat a little bit longer um, because he's over there watching a YouTube video, which is funny because I'm filming one. Um, and I wanted to get some um, ideas. So, I'm just curious. So, when you follow somebody on YouTube, like, what is the reason that you, A, click on their video? Is it the caption, the picture? Like, what is it? Like, what draws you in? Like, I want to say a lot of times it's like, like, I follow this family that's, um, the Earl's family, I just love them. And, like, she's there, like, trying for baby number four. So, like, the other day they put up that, like, she was taking a pregnancy test. And so, it really got my attention. So, I'm curious what is it is it the picture of the person like if they're really pretty um is it what they say like i'm just curious like what draws you in so let me know in the comments i'm gonna pick somebody to send a ten dollar either starbucks to chick-fil-a to like whatever you want um so i'm just curious like what kind of draws you in um 
also, side note, if y'all didn't know, we have, let's see if I can show all the detail. Don't peep our curtain back there. So we have a rice bed. So as you'll see, like eventually when we give more updates with like house and stuff, I love like traditional Southern. So Joel and I actually have a very old, see all I told y'all my hair was just, it's not it today. But um, we have a very old original like southern rice bed and I love it. We actually caught it on Facebook Marketplace. We love Facebook Marketplace. We're a Facebook Marketplace family and this lady like puts up that she has this rice bed and she's like it's free shut up like I'm obsessed like I have to have this bed so before we ever got married my dad and Joel went to get it y'all free looked it up after we got it y'all like used these are like three thousand dollar beds I was like and it's ours like how is this ours sorry I'm so used to not filming like I'm looking in the viewfinder um so but that's just like a secret we have like a really pretty gold frame wedding picture that my mom got us um, or my parents got us for Christmas, like two, not not this year, but maybe the year before that I've got to hang up. But it's one of those like we're really hoping we're gonna find a house. So like I love it. like it's so gorgeous. I'll have to show you. Um, I just don't know if I want to hang it yet. You know, um, like we really need something. Um, but if you haven't watched our wedding video, you should watch that. It's on here. Um, and we're gonna be married three years this year, which is insane. Thing. like I just can't believe that it's already gonna be three years like it's just nuts so like flashback because I was actually texting my friend Taylor about it today like how crazy our wedding was um because I really honestly don't know if I've really talked about it that much but since I'm just rambling um we got married in June so we're actually supposed to get married family property we'll skip that whole fiasco fun and so we actually did change our wedding venue like Wednesday or Thursday of the week for our wedding because they were calling for seven inches of rain. So we actually got wound up getting married at a beautiful church. Um, they were perfect, wonderful. I can't say enough great things about it. The church was beautiful. And we were actually on CS to the Dress Atlanta, which was really exciting. Um, so if you don't watch that episode, you should watch it. Um, and then we actually changed our reception the morning of our wedding. So my dad calls me on the phone and he's actually with Joel and like Joel's helping him get everything ready. Like it wasn't your typical like relaxing wedding day. There was no beers to be had. There was none of that. Um, and dad calls and he's like, yeah, so your chairs are floating. So I'm pretty sure you're not gonna be able to have the reception here or the wedding. Like there's nothing gonna happen here. And I'm like, it's your worst nightmare as a bride so we actually changed also our reception on the day of our wedding and we had a great friend Griffin um which if you live in Atlanta they own Alexander Produce at the farmer's market so you should go see them um but the, he brought his box truck and just like literally just had the most amazing people help us move but that's just a side note of our crazy wedding this is coming up this summer and I just like I'm three years and I'm, I get in my feels sometimes but um so yeah, let me know um, kind of what you look for, what you click on for your picture now that I went on this total rabbit trail about our wedding. So I was talking to Taylor about it today and I'm like, okay, wait, I don't know if I've ever told them about that. We got married at McDonough Methodist. Um, if you're familiar with Georgia, that's in Henry County, which is where we're originally from. Um, we don't live there anymore. But um, yeah, so we got married at that. It's beautiful. If you're ever looking for a beautiful uh, wedding venue, they have beautiful white marble floors and honestly I have no regrets about that day like the most perfect wedding venue like the reception wasn't my favorite but that I loved um so that's just a little update um yeah so now I'm just rambling and I'm getting tired but I just felt like it wasn't long enough and I just wanted to come on here and tell you a little more like just thoughts and chat because he's over here just I won't jake so that's sure no, but he's just watching his stuff so i hope y'all enjoyed this and i will um let me know if y'all want to select. okay first of all let me know what y'all want to see if y'all want to see a day in the life what i eat in a day on keto but i'm going to upload the video of jack is updated feeding so that's not options so 
stay in the light or what a donkey did. Y'all let me know.